Nathan Vasha. Of the M Vasha. I'm like, oh, this is unlike me. But everything do. I love it. I love it. I love it. You look good. I love like it. <laughs> you look good. Yeah. Okay. We're going to meet up with Abraham. Uh, we were supposed to meet Mapema Kidogo, but you took longer than you expected. So we're going to meet up with him. We have some. We have dinner. We catch up with Kidogo. Yes. Because this is something we normally do in our family. So it's been long. Yeah, it's been um, we catch up, we know, we, we find out our things, we know what to do, where we're going wrong and all that. So what do you have to tell them, Sarah? <laughs> I'm going to enjoy it. Yes, I'll see you later. So here we're just settling in and I guess the menu has to be a QR code scan then we have to go through it and discuss because you just can order without over consulting especially when there are two To decide what they really want so I just have to order this one so just they're just eating up my head on this particular issue of settling in especially on the accompaniment so how about you give us a platter uh, yeah a mix of chicken mutton and a bit of pork if it's on the menu of the platter and then for compliments, they can actually help with that. Sarah, anything? Okay, fine. It's decided. I have to choose what you're going to eat today. On the next one, they will have to make a decision on this. Uh, Abraham decided to at least share with us. So here Abraham was telling us about how his day was when he was busy and he was still mad at us because we didn't manage meeting at uh, the day do you know we were supposed to meet up for lunch yes I remember that <laughs> but time yeah, but I think we took so long in the salon 
yeah it, it took longer than you expected the love because we did an extreme makeover mm. yeah make uh that's why it took that long yeah uh-huh. so here we were discussing about uh, okay he was very mad at first so we had to apologize <laughs> and tell him it was not our fault <laughs> We were trying to explain ourselves. And then do you remember the way the, the, the traffic? Yeah, there was traffic. The there traffic was traffic. Was heavy. Yeah. Yes. What was that? Uh, Abraham was okay. I think did you Al Tokamapema? He was on phone like every uh, after every like fifth after every like five minutes mm-hmm. yes he was on phone but it's business uh uh best ch- uh what do we call it somebody go chef? best chef meal of the day <laughs> soup of the day, of yes the soup. <laughs> so soup sorry yeah mm-hmm. i love you here we were buttering that casmol that casmol bread my <laughs> hey my dears i don't know what it's called <laughs> Mina kaita hako kadogo na the kavata kwanza the butter it was so nice so ah pia hapa tulikuwa tu tunakumbuka what we we went through what we what we tulipata na nao kwa salon most of the, some of them were our fans eh uh, can't i remember <laughs> that lady she was like oh sarah she came and gave me a very big hug now, now the other one alisema sarah morin come say hi eh <laughs> <laughs> yeah, wengine walikuwa naona ni car they thought that it's pr so they were excited when walitu ana pamoja so it's not pr mm-hmm. so is, is that's what we were trying to explain to baba <laughs> and it was so nice kuona na na wow kuona nice mm-hmm. eh yeah, we love we love them so much mm-hmm. So, um, Abraham I guess alimaliza soup yake haraka sana ama mbele yetu So I had kumumisha Morin can you could like the soup <laughs> You didn't finish it I didn't finish it I, I think ile fatu mali ni ka ni katu ikanishimisha eh eh sio kama ta heavy watu wa kasupu ni mimi sana sana na abraham eh ni watu wa kasupu mimi mimi ni kadogo tu and i was okay so apa si juni kwa na ex na try ku explain nini ulikuwa na try kusema Okay like unko na try kusema vya una feel like you are relieved leo mm-hmm. mecha mtoto mm-hmm. uko la sisi as in you you are out of the house True. eh mm-hmm. Now the food came look yummy So from there eh uh, oh you served abraham 
and then you serve yourself we started eating now we'll talk you the importance of this dinner like us going out of the house because we also had an option of staying inside the house and it's uh it makes you feel better we can go out there and discuss it's easier discussing in a new environment we rekindle our friendship and uh we at least with that it helps a lot to the family mm, me would say it was a it was a good thing that we did abraham has been has been so supportive I know it's not an easy thing. Uh, so we decided with Maureen we should take him for that cadet. <laughs> yeah, we uh, took him for dinner. Mm. Uh, he didn't expect that mm. from us. <laughs> so we took him uh, there and uh, we made sure he had one of his best meals and uh, with that that man I know he felt appreciated. That is what we should always do for our spouse. And especially that that part where we told him that we were we were the ones who are going to pay for the bill. He was like, "Oh. Wow. <laughs> so you guys can also treat me." <laughs> yeah, mm-hmm. so people out there, you should once in a while do something like out of the norm to you, man. At least he feels better. They are also human being like us. They want to be treated differently. You know, and you know those small small things that we do for our partners, they really matter a lot. You don't have to like cut he have like do 20k, 50k for you to surprise him. Those small small things yeah. they go a long way. Unaweza jaza tanks kumoja. Sema kama mbaya mbaya. Kama mbaya mbaya. Yeah, you buy him something, ama you get him something. At least he's going to feel appreciated. And with that, inapunguzanga vita kwa nyumba ni kweli. Because we we also have to fight for that. And then you know that it can't be like all the time ni ye kutoa kutoa kutoa. Mm. Mm-hmm. So on this particular day uh, the topic that took the day was um, a simple discussion about finances and uh, I would like to pose a question to your to our viewers how well do you plan your finances out there do you just wake up and do things you just wake up and you bought land today you wake up and you just bought a car today you wake up and you start you know investing in things you didn't plan about So having a proper um well structured financial framework comes in handy especially when you have a family because uh, there's a lot of thing that so many things require that go beyond the basic needs there is the food how much are you spending on buying food how much do you spend on housing how much do you spend on your lifestyle you know all these are factors at the empire we try to factor in as much as we can it is not easy at times their budget goes a bit higher than expected it's a big family that's why we have a reason to plan out we have development goals we have um, career goals we have you know you name it we we take these kind of opportunities to go deep into what is needed so we urge you guys out there plan out as much as you can
remember to like, share, subscribe, and subscribe. leave a comment. Tuambie venye tulikuwa tunakaa. Tuambie wali nataka to upgrade, wali nataka you can ask us questions. We have some